I know what a bitch that shit is to solo on regular. I can't even imagine soloing that on master. You literally get two shot by the fucking Scion, even with a hundred resilience. <clears throat> You'd literally have to play perfect. Damn. Like, not a single error. What? These must be like content of pieces. Some of these names, I've never seen these destinations before. Of course, Bungie has vaulted about 65% of the game. Shall never understand how a game a company can get away with making you buy DLCs, then taking them from you, then making you rebuy them. Well, fuck that. Yeah. They tried doing that shit in Dead by Daylight when you had to release those packages, and if you already bought them, you had to get Wait. everything they added in addition to your packages. Fucked up. No, I mean, like, what? they had to give it to you. Oh, shit. Well, yeah, I wish Bungie was like that. Bungie decided they were gonna have us buy DLCs. Then they turned around and for some odd reason, well, I guess without thinking, put the DLCs for free on the Game Pass. And then like, a half a year ago decided, okay, we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna take these all. Took all the DLCs away, and then the people who paid for the DLCs, they turned around and vaulted the content and made them rebuy it. Then they turned around. Mm -hmm. Then they turned around and they vaulted it again. Like all this shit we're doing right now, this is all gonna get vaulted. We're missing like eight planets. A lot of my fucking pinnacles that are left now are like dungeon shit. Mm-hmm, raising dungeons, but you're good because they give you a pretty chunky Come fucking here. pinnacle. Yeah, like, get get first for the Vanguard, they'll, they'll usually give you maybe like three, four lay hard once you are, but if you do like a raid with the dungeons for the pinnacle, it's usually going to be almost like 10 plus light hard once you are, especially the raid. I've been seeing uh, I need to be in a lot of raids. people have been getting 1580 gear from the King's Fall raid this week. Yeah. That's what I need. That's why I'm gonna raid be doing King's mm, I'm gonna be doing King's Fall. So well, later today I should say. Um oh, yeah. it's really not that bad. Once you understand that the mechanics that shit is a breeze, and this is actually one of the lesser <laughs> intense raids we have. Mm -hmm. Plus the weapons that it has, they're just they're too good not to get it. Well, for those raids? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this one in particular, there, but... King's Fall, because scout rifle you can get from it is the only scout rifle in the game that can roll with uh, experience. Uh, Firefly and Explosive Payload, but it can also roll with Firefly and Dragonfly, so you're getting both a solar and an elemental explosion on precision hits. And then the Pulse Rifle can get uh, Dragonfly, and it's the only Pulse Rifle in the game that can get Explosive Payload on it. And then the Hand Cannon which is bomb after that can get um, the incandescent and dragonfly part, but it can also get um, incandescent and explosive rounds, and that's, that's fucking massive in PvE. Oh, yeah. But I'm after the exotic, which is the touch of malice. 
that's what I'm that, talking about. I've been hearing shit about that. That guy. thing is fucking I mean, that guy, crack. What's about that weapon? That weapon is so powerful that for the last week I've watched people kill raid bosses with that thing, and it's a fucking scout rifle. And they have killed raid bosses, and I'm talking seconds, like ten seconds. It is cracked right now because whatever they did to it, they amplified the damage, and then out with the catalyst. Every time you pretty much get a precision kill, it does like a whop sum of damage, and it also blinds and debuffs definitely. And how do you get that from that nightfall shirt? Nah, that's just from King's Fall Ray, just getting to the final boss and hoping it drops, but they seem to have really increase the drop rate on it compared to D1. Damn. So that's why I'm after it, because it's a really talented gun, because Destiny 1, you had to have the touch of mouse to actually do the raid. If you didn't have the touch of mouse, you could not DPS the final boss. Man, let me know when you go in that shit, man. I need to try that shit, too. Mm, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely 100% running uh, that shit later today, because I've been missing out on it since it dropped two weeks ago, and it's like... I know the whole mechanics to it, I just need to get people for it. Plus, I wouldn't mind trying to teach more people how to actually do it. Mm. I mean, Vortiglass is simple. There's really not much out of that, but I wanted to move a Plus, King's Fall, once you actually learn, it's, a, it's quite a fun raid, especially the jumping puzzles. Oh, shit. Because there will be a part after the, uh, the first encounter where pretty much you and your whole fire team have to, like, jump from, like, floating ships to ship. And if you miss the ship, you fuck. <laughs> oh yeah, I've, 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 yeah, I've seen that on here, yeah, that shit, the ship shit, yeah. That's why I'll be taking my good and trusty other half of Eager's Edge to yeet myself across the map, not worried about that shit. Of course, and I was going to use my hunter and the, uh, you know, Dire Falk Exotic, but disabled, so it looks like I'm going to look on the Crash Titan. I didn't know you uh you could thunder crash the final boss. I didn't think it would work, but I'm sure you I can. watched the dude. I watched the dude this morning. Fucking his whole team was dead. Boss had like a quarter of health left. He was about to die. Just straight fucking uh, orcs was getting ready to uh, slam down because if you don't do enough damage to him, he will slam down and wipe the whole team. And right as he was getting ready to wipe the team, this dude thunder crashed and killed him. Perfect time now, right? Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, so it does work on him. That's nice to know. A little salty there because I accidentally deleted my fucking lowly splendor. <laughs> I'm about to go farm for that helmet again. But honestly, Mm, honestly, I ain't going to, because at this point, I'm pretty much a full manning arc titan. It's just too strong, and it's just a blast, especially with the grenade build that I have. I realized the potency that they made the grenade build for him. Like, I have the capability if I go on um and all right, gamers, that brings us to the end of yet another video. So do me a favor. If you are watching on Twitch, make sure you hit that follow and the share button. It helps out more than you realize. Then I want you to head on over to our main page, which is found on YouTube. Over there, you can see all of our edited videos. Thumbs up the ones you like. Hit that like and subscribe button. Flicker ding dong so that way you don't miss out on more kick ass content from me and the Gamers Purgatory crew. And until the next video, I will be seeing you. Peace.